Hi, I'm Dwayne Strew. I'm a realtor in Edmonton, Alberta, and I wanted to give you a bit of an update in terms of what's been happening in the real estate market in Edmonton, Alberta over the first two months of 2024. February sales are in and they were a really strong, uh, it was a really strong month for sales. Sales were up actually 53%. So this is the number of properties selling uh, over February of 2023. But I will remind you that February 2023 was not a strong month. We had come through a really slow winter uh, because of the rapid rise in interest rates in 2022 and that really hampered our, our market and so yeah we're comparing to 2023 which was not a great month but they are up 53 percent they're down if we look back to 2022 february sales are down um, about 13 percent but 2022 uh, was a remarkable month for sales um, so now uh, the other part of the equation, of course, um, that goes along with demand is supply. So what's happening with the supply? Well, the inventory is continuing to trend down. Uh, Month-end inventory at the end of February compared to last February was down 17%. That's a pretty significant number. So we have uh, more sales, we have less inventory. Uh, of course, that's going to result in, in rising prices. And, and that has, um, in fact, been the case. So if we compare prices from February 2024 to February 2023, we'll see single family homes are up about 10.5%, um, semi-detached up about 7.5%, townhouses up about 9%. Unfortunately, apartment style condos, man, they, they still continue to fall. They're down about 3% or just over 3%. Uh, just not a lot of demand for those apartment style condos, some more so than others. But uh, where I'm really seeing a lot of demand for people who are moving into Alberta uh, is for the townhouses, the half duplex, um, and maybe the, the uh, entry level uh, detached single family homes. Uh, that's we're probably seeing the most demand. Now keep in mind when I say these prices are up, again, we're comparing to last February, February 2023, um, and prices have fallen quite a bit that winter. So if we compare the prices at, at uh, the end of February to where they were last spring, they're, they're much closer. I won't go through them all, but, but the prices are much closer to where they were last spring. Um, but I do uh, anticipate that you know, for the rest of this spring, we're going to see increased sales. Uh, we're going to see some more inventory inventory come on, uh, but I don't think that's going to be enough to discourage prices. I think we will still continue to see uh, prices going up over the next few months anyway. Thanks for watching, everyone. Uh, stay tuned. Uh, we'll give, give you another update in a month's time.